Hello, everyone. You know the deal with the challenge. I'm going to describe it anyway. This is episode four. All it is is I reached a million point points, and please, I know how much I really, I really wanted to get that seven-digit number, but I'm not going to play another game just for two thousand seven hundred points. Allow me to be a little bit efficient with my time. <laughs> so, I get to pretty damn close to a million, or straight up a million. I spend my blood points to get to level uh, 50, or at least it's close enough to level 50, and then I have to do another set of videos to get to level 50. So, you know, I spent a million to get to 38, now I have to spend a million to get to 50. That's basically the gist of it. But I personally know that it will only take about or around 500,000, so that 2,000 will hardly ever matter at all. And, uh, let's get right into it! That is it, and whoops, I forgot to go to the loadout. That's the that's the Prestige 2, so this is episode 3 through 4 is Prestige 2 usually, and then 5 through 6 is Prestige 3 and the same amount of levels. We didn't get very many good, like, actual perks. I actually just was doing this build in my free time, so uh, ignore it. I do like play with your food spirit, but we'll try something different because I did already do that in the series. The aura reading build. Hmm. I do like aura reading. And like, play with your food. I mean, not play with your food. Uh, Pop goes a weasel. To, you know, slow down the game by like a shit ton. I don't think Tinker would be great on Spirit. I guess sounds great, but. Maybe Hex Devour Hope? Yeah, let's do Devour Hope. I'll try this build out. Uh, let's get right into it. I actually changed my mind. Instead of Devour Hope... I've actually changed my mind in that instead of Devour Hope, I am going for Strider because I forgot that I got Strider. Strider is just too helpful and I can't just ignore it. So now... Now we'll start. Alright, this is like game number four or something, I don't remember. Damn. I mean like... I'm still like debating whether to have my first game as a game, still. Never had that happen before. Oh my god! I was trying to hear if someone was working on the gym behind me, and they were actually. At least I'm pretty sure they were. But then I saw her running back, and I was like, "Time to stay." Hi. I knew you were here. Ah! 
I don't know where you went. Master of my games. <laughs> I would say I should be able to hear her, and I guess she has iron will, which is why I could barely hear her at all. All three of them are working on that one right there. Hey, you mind if I hop in? I guess all three of them weren't. I love how there's a totem there. Why haven't they broken it? I doubt it would work again. I had a strange suspicion it would not work again. Hey, I see you guys healing over there. And if I join in... You guys probably heard me smashing that spacebar and everything. Oh my god. Let's try it. Don't shake your no at me. You probably have deep strike. I don't give a shit. There's only four gens left, so. worth your life though it probably was like when i see a youtuber complain about this like was it really worth completing the gym in my face and it absolutely fucking is Yeah, I need to stop that gen, sorry. Now you won't have that next time. But then they're actually gonna I complete the gen in my face. Oh. Oh. 
I love that little whoosh thing she does. Really cool. Okay, I guess she got away. Some bitch was still here. Oh my god. <laughs> Gotta get back to the other gym like really fast. I still haven't, like, even chased one person, or, like, hooked to them, like, at all. I think this was the person. I haven't seen her all game. Really? I wanted to hit her before for the obvious reason that she might have had a... I played her, but I messed up really bad, so that was my fault. It's not like she did hard it or anything like that. That was my completely my fault. And that time it felt like it was my fault. I played that wrong. I should have went. I wanted to go up here. What I wanted to do, but I thought it was the other way for some reason. That uh, screwed me up pretty big. Are they just running around trying to find Hatch? Damn. Well, I mean, I guess double damn. Doug dibble damn. Doug dill dibble damn dibble damn. Gotta be the dibble damn dibble damn dibble damn.
lose all hope, young ones. I just heard it open as I was smashing it out, and I'm like, oh shit. Those are not very close gates, like at all. <laughs> like at all. You can easily escape this. He so chooses it. Chooses it. to check the other gate now. But I feel like she would go f she did go for this one. Yeah, you fucked up by running to it. I can't even see her. I'm just, I'm just following the old red scratch mark trail. <laughs> You're planning on looping it. Oh, this seems like a bad idea. Let me tell you. I also lost complete track of you. Like, it's hard to hear for, like, all those noises. Wow. Oh. It's hard to hear noises when that, there's that blaring alarm noise going on. <laughs> and she also had Iron Will, so it was really hard to hear her. I shouldn't have tried to do the spear thing. I didn't even know she had a key, but apparently she grabbed one from somewhere. So, uh, GG well played. I think, uh, since this was two hatch escapes, I'm just going to count the first game that I played as a, a game that just happened. And although it was me basically just tunneling a person, I just, I don't know. <sighs> I'll try and get one more game in. Oh boy. Whew. Oh man. Okay. Let's try it. Adam Field's never really a good map for any killer. There's too many places to hide. There's a lot of good god pallets happening. I would like to score a hit before using my power, but it doesn't always happen. Hopefully I forced him to leave. And it did. <laughs> dead hearted into a little uh, body block trap there, dude. <laughs> so sorry. <laughs> I'm not gonna make it to there, but I'm damn darn tootin' gonna try. Like, every time I see two people in a gen, it never, I never make it in time. Yep. It never works, because two people on a gen is just too fast. Especially with toolboxes and free thyself. <laughs> it's 
So I wasted a pop charge going for a gen that was impossible for me to get, which is unfortunate, but you know, that's how the game goes. So. Oh my god. I might not even make this hook. There's so many things in the way. Why are you doing this? I'll do it. I'll do it. Did her? I mean, if she was never going to even attempt to grab, it would be more worth my time to hit her. I might have to get this D-Strike out of the way, but fuck, like, I can't have my time wasted either. He's in a locker. <laughs> Huh? Alright. Hope your D-Strike did not work, sir. I hate when like I hate these with such a passion. Like I had to do another chase with her, even and that would have resulted in her death, but she avoided it with these strike. Because like she can. It's never like a good feeling. Can I have her healing under hook? I have a strong suspicion she has we'll make it. Damn. Still got her anyway somehow. I kind of do need someone to like super fast. Am I gonna get eat another dead strike? D strike? Because yep. they can't live without it. Oh man, he had to take the pallet there. Like, it's so annoying that I had to take D strikes like that. Yeah. Yeah. Like, I'm just so good at the game, but I get punished because I'm so good at the game. This doesn't sound fair.
And I'm not saying I'm actually good at the game. I'm just saying I played well, but it didn't matter. I wanted to grab him, but I guess not. Like, are these guys about to lose even though they had to have two D strikes against me? I was not working on anything. I didn't, I didn't remember destroying that pallet. <laughs> I'm gonna be honest. I knew I heard grass rustling. I fucking knew it. Yeah, when you, I said this before, but when you play Spirit, you really gotta learn how to get those uh, audio cues down. You really gotta learn it. I'm gonna. Want, I want to kill the Jane because uh, she distracted me, and uh, that wasn't very nice of her. I'm not going to resist, I'm going to take her to the basement. to kill the Jane so fucking badly. I'd rather this Ash live. Even though he's basically just been gen rushing the entire game. Which gen rushing isn't a bad thing. But at the same time, like it's still a problem that needs to be addressed. Because like gens can be done so fast. You better not have a key or anything. Doesn't look like you do. Oh, as long as you don't have, if you don't have a key, I can just do this all day. She does have a key. Oh my god, she can escape. Ah! Fuck off. You're not escaping. I'll allow the Ash to escape, but you know. If you, if you that desperately need fucking D-Strike and a key to live, you don't really deserve it. At least Ash was trying to do the objectives. Like, fuck.
poor Ash, dude. Like, who's just doing objectives and then you're just running around it with a key trying to just escape by yourself? But then you also had to use D Strike. Like, keep in mind, like, two D Strikes, they're fucking huge. Like, I've said this loads of times. D Strike adds a health state, it adds a hook state because you would have been hooked. Most, more than likely, unless, you know, body blocking or someone sabotaged the hook or something like that. There's still ways to not get hooked, but D-Strike pretty much guarantees it within a minute, and that's fact. It's not a great perk design, in my humble opinion. It gives a hell state because you go from down to being injured, and people seem to, like, argue that for some reason, like, it's, like, not a thing, but it is. You literally have to do, you literally go from down to being healthy. You stun the killer for five seconds, that's fucking huge. And then you basically add a whole nother chase, and if I just leave you and you get healed, you get, that's humongous survivor pressure. Just because someone picked you up within a minute, that's... That ain't had a gate this entire time. Like, that was a super obvious hatch. Not, of course, I didn't actually, you know, find it, but it just seems like they should have. Uh... Oh, GGs. If I had add-ons or, you know, like, things like that. Might have gotten you. And a lot of things would have had- A lot of things the game would have gone way differently if I had add-ons. But yeah, he was doing the gen rush build, like for myself, and then like toolboxes. Um, here was like the D strike that pretty much D strike head on and whatnot. D strike, kindred, I guess. I had to eat both D strikes, and I still came up on top. So I hope you guys enjoyed. I'm still not sure if I'm going to do the first video or not. I did. This is well, this was the second game I got a 3k in, and. I did get two, you know, nice three Ks in. Like I didn't tunnel or camp or anything, you know, like that. But my first game, I did tunnel, and then like they escaped through hatch, even though like there were still three people alive. I was able to get a two K, and then the other person escaped through the eight K. So I didn't know if I should count that or not, and I guess I just won't because you know, fuck it. So anyway, hope you guys enjoyed. Bye.